doesn't love a little J-Lo? Welcome to Ms. Mojo, and today we'll be counting down our picks for the top 10 Jennifer Lopez movie performances. Before we begin, we publish new videos every day, so be sure to subscribe for more great content. For this list, we will only be looking at Lopez's absolute best live action performances. I came to help you. So her voiceover turn as Azteca in Ants will not be included. Jeez, I love my work. And you, well, you think too much. Number 10, Terry Flores, Anaconda. Snakes don't eat people. In this monster flick, a documentary film crew searching for a long lost tribe find themselves being hunted by a massive anaconda while traveling along the Amazon River. Lopez plays Terry, director of the documentary and de facto leader of the group. Showing off her abilities as a scream queen, Lopez turns in a solid performance in this cult classic. This film was supposed to be my big break. It's turned out to be a big disaster. While the film is a far cry from others in her filmography, Lopez never phones it in. Instead, she manages to use the movie's tongue-in-cheek humor to her advantage, creating a character that refuses to be ignored. What choice do I have? Number 9. Jean Gilkison, An Unfinished Life I'm a good person. No stranger to dramatic roles, J-Lo shines in this film about a curmudgeonly Wyoming rancher who's forced to care for his estranged daughter-in-law. Lopez plays Jean, a single mother who's struggling to get over the loss of her husband. I tried to keep living and you haven't. Is that why you hate me so much? Starring opposite a couple of film legends like Robert Redford and Morgan Freeman, Lopez does an excellent job of keeping her character both entertaining and believable. While it is next to impossible to steal the spotlight from such stiff competition, this doesn't stop the talented entertainer from trying. That's what your love feels like. Number 8. Gertie Steine, Jersey Girl You don't understand what it's like to be this fat! After his wife dies during childbirth, a New York City media publicist struggles to balance his work with his responsibilities as a single father. Lopez is only in this film for a short period of time but she still manages to turn in a memorable and hilarious performance. All the other girls are gonna be skinny and I'm gonna look like a whale! As the aforementioned wife, Lopez is barely around long enough to get a screen credit, but her character's death serves as the film's catalyst. Featuring exactly the kind of comedy that a Kevin Smith film is known for, Lopez finds a way to do a lot with a little. Now you have to be the guy who's done by six and comes home and hangs out with his family. Number 7, Dr. Catherine Dean, The Cell. Did Daddy do a bad thing? This film is part science fiction, part psychological thriller, offering an intense look at what happens when a child psychologist enters the fractured and dangerous mind of a serial killer. Lopez plays the lead character, Catherine, the psychologist tasked with unraveling the psyche of a madman. This role was a far cry from anything the young actress had done previously, and she performs admirably. <laughs> While the plot is at times convoluted, Lopez does her best to impart upon the viewer a sense of stability. As a side note, don't forget that this is the film for which Lopez won the prestigious title of Best Dressed at the MTV Movie Awards. Number 6. Mary Fiore, The Wedding Planner You saved my shoe. Jennifer Lopez and Matthew McConaughey star opposite one another in a San Francisco-based rom-com, where do we sign up? Mary is a successful wedding planner who ends up falling for her current client's fiancé. Filled with exactly the kind of romantic shenanigans that the genre is known for, Lopez finds a way to subvert these tropes with her plethora of acting talent. She shares an obvious chemistry with McConaughey that incites the question, why don't they work together more often? Where'd you learn to dance like this? Ballroom class. The film was ultimately a box office success with Lopez managing once again to show off a different side of herself. Because I love a challenge! Number 5. Slim Hiller, Enough Don't beg, you look like a dog. After watching this film, we know better than to mess with J-Lo. Constantly on the run from her abusive husband, Slim Hiller learns how to fight back in order to protect herself and her daughter. Can't you hit me again even once? Easily one of the actress's darkest films, Lopez does an excellent job as the single mother who decides enough is enough. Her ability to command a scene is on full display in this dramatic thriller, as she throws herself wholeheartedly into the role of Slim Hiller. <laughs> we aren't sure if Lopez still remembers the fighting techniques from this flick, but just to be safe, 
we'd recommend staying on her good side. I told you, self-defense. Number four, Paulina, shall we dance? The rumba is a vertical expression of a horizontal wish. What is it about this film that's so darn charming? The dancing, the hilarious and heartfelt performances, Jenny from the block straight up killing it on the dance floor, it's probably a mix of the three. When depressed businessman John Clark joins a dance studio, in the hopes of meeting a mysterious dancer named Paulina, he gets much more than he bargained for. What made you want to dance? You. Lopez is awesome in the role of Paulina. She once again shows that she's more than just a pretty face, proving her worthiness as an actor from start to finish. You look blue. Breathe. Number 3, Marissa Ventura, Made in Manhattan. Housekeeping. Who could forget this classic rom-com? When hotel maid Marissa is mistaken for a Manhattan socialite, it leads to a surprising romantic adventure with an up-and-coming senatorial candidate. The first time that you saw me, I was... You were mesmerizing. After a number of dramatic roles, Jayla was finally able to show the world that she could be a comedic lead as well. The talented actress carries the film from start to finish, using her natural charisma to its full potential. While Made in Manhattan isn't exactly Oscar material, a strong performance from Jennifer Lopez nevertheless makes it an enjoyable flick. I can't believe you said that! <laughs> Number 2, Karen Sisko, Out of Sight. You wanted to tussle, we tussled. Based on the novel by renowned crime writer Elmore Leonard, this film is the story of escaped bank robber Jack Foley and the relationship he develops with Karen Sisko, the U.S. Marshal tasked with bringing him in. You must really see yourself as some kind of Clyde Barrow, huh? Lopez's turn as the woman hot on Foley's tail is one of the highlights of her career. It allowed her to flex some serious acting muscle, going toe-to-toe -to -toe with film heavyweights such as George Clooney, Don Cheadle, and Ving Rhames. Her character is a superb mixture of brains, brawn, and beauty, three things Lopez has in spades. If the world didn't know her before this film came out, it certainly did after. Jack, please don't make me do this. Put the gun down. Before we unveil our top pick, here are a few honorable mentions. Lucky didn't happen out in the desert. Day like today, you'd be dead in no time. And all I'm asking, is for you to give me a small piece so I can get the hell out of here. Number one, Selena. Selena. <laughs> this film is the true story of Tejano singer Selena, who slowly became one of the most popular Mexican-American entertainers of the 1990s. For Lopez, this was her chance to show the world that she had what it took to be a leading actress, and she did not disappoint. J-Lo does a fantastic job of channeling the late singer, both on and off stage. I may not be streetwise and all that, but at least I know not to be that dumb. Film critics were quick to point out that this was a star-making turn for the young actress. If only they knew what was to come. Selena remains one of Lopez's most complete performances to date. Come on, let me see you dance. I was just kidding. Come on, come on, let me see you dance. Don't be shy. Do you agree with our picks? Check out these other great clips from Ms. Mojo and subscribe for new videos every day.